Good morning, gurus. I hope you're having a beautiful day. I just woke up. Iran just got attacked by Israel, retaliatory attack, apparently. And Iran, they're not so, um, I wouldn't say they're so, they, that they would be calm enough to not retaliatory attack back to Israel. I know my hair, everyone, this is my natural hair. I just woke up. So in my opinion, this current attack dropped Bitcoin to 65K. But now we're going into the weekend. We're going into the election. Iran will retaliate because it always does and Israel always does because they don't understand that Jesus is, quote, an eye for an eye and the whole world will be blind. So this will escalate, unfortunately. But there is some things that dip very heavily and I'm going to try and buy those up. And what what is showing strength? We're going to look at what's showing strength during this dip. Hit the subscribe button, smash up, thumbs up, and turn on the bell. Let me know in the comment section who who listened to my warning. Very dangerous big, um, Bitcoin charts. And I was warning everyone the last week. I've been nearly all in cash. I still took a hit because I bought some Doge yesterday. I bought some Uni, like 50K Doge, 30K Uni. So those dropped a little bit but still quite up in cash and ready to buy dips. Let's jump into the technicals for Bitcoin now. Actually, I want to go into the charts, the technicals. So this is the news. Um, you can see here. Uh, remember everyone who's been telling you the last to be super bullish on Bitcoin and crypto the last days while I pulled out money and warned everyone to get out and something dangerous is happening. I've been holding off to buy for a few days and look at this world drop 15%, Salon 8%, Doge 9%, Sui 12%, Ton 8%, massive bloodbath. Um, this line is a long way down. This is a rising wedge on Bitcoin. We don't know how low it can go, but 53K could be the target. Plus the stochastic is overbought on the weekly as I've been showing you. I warned everyone. Now I'm going to try 19 explosions heard in Tehran and Karj. So right now, Iran apparently did get attacked. Um, let's look at the charts. Bitcoin is trying to hold on here. It's trying to hold the line. It came all the way down to 6,500. We go close to the one minute on Binance. And you can see there was huge buys that tried to hold it up at 65k. We had, we had the number of buys needed, around 300 buys Bitcoin per minute to hold it up. And it is trying to hold. However, I think it's dangerous to buy here going into the weekend, to be honest. Because if you look at it, you can zoom out. You can see there's a um, big rising wedge kind of forming. Wait, I put it on this chart. <clears throat> see? Rising wedge, everyone. Rising wedges on the daily charts. Very bearish pattern. Builds pressure and breaks down to the base of the wedge. Target would be 53k. But some things already got hit pretty hard. Like World... Goat is up 5% during this drop. So people bought Goat. We bought it at 35 cents. I posted on my Twitter. I bought some World just now. So you can see my account on Bybit. So World, Uni, Sui got hit very hard and Doge. And we can see over on Bybit, my account is 700k. Took still a hit even though I was nearly all in cash. I am still got dropped off around 6k just now on spot. You can see here I lost around 10k on spot on this drop. I bought some World just now. You can see my spot buys. This is my spot holdings, everyone. So I've got MCRT 82K, slightly down 4%. Doge 50K, which I bought yesterday, but I bought 50K worth down 8%. Let's buy some Doge on this drop, but I think let's buy 5K. I'm buying some Doge on this drop, 5K. Now I'm starting to shop, um, but it can get much worse. So 5K, 5K. I'm, I'm mainly in cash. So I just bought 15k worth of Doge. You can see here Doge. Let's see when these orders execute. Doge. Well, oh, one order is down there. Um, let's see what else took a big hit. What's showing strength? Goat showing massive strength. Tesla was up 3% after 20% yesterday. Um, Bitcoin showing strength, actually. The altcoins got mainly hit by this. I bought some World as well. You can see I'm holding now... 10, 20k worth of world that took a big drop as well let's i want to buy some world but bitcoin can fall more so i'm i'm not going to go long on bitcoin till the rising wedge plays out okay that's 15k worth of world that will execute so i'll have 35k worth of world i'll have let's buy some uni that also took a big hit so of my account so of 700k I've got positions of 80, 50, 30, 30. So 60, 110. 
so i've got 110 plus 80 so 200k or 700k is crypto so 500k is just cash <clears throat> um uniswap let's buy more i like uniswap and it took quite a strong hit uniswap so let's see world 14 percent sui uni doge ton took a huge hit ton is trying to hold the line ton 350 would be the time to buy if it doesn't hold this line and it looks like it's not going to actually um doge uni world 18 cents world big volume coming to war but yep stochastic heading down as well so we'll revisit a dollar 40 so we'll get worse it looks like so i'll keep mainly cash so i got 82k mcrt 56k doge uni let's reduce i don't want to add too much here let's get some more doge because hmm, 56k doge took eight percent hit but it looks like it will get worse okay let's see i've got 50, so I have 60k Doge, 32k Uni. Let's check out Uni. Uni also coming back into the channel. Great, good place to buy Uni would be on major support. I mean, it was just at, just in August, like a two months ago, it was at $4.60. So need to enter slowly here. Uni, World. I'll leave it at that. I bought some World. I bought some Doge. I bought some Uni. I haven't gone long on Bitcoin yet. I haven't gone long on Bitcoin. Let's check out Bitcoin technicals. Because of the rising wedge and Iran and Israel will keep escalating. They're not like peaceful people. Both sides of the of those Iran and Israel, they're not known for their... Like, if someone attacks me, I will just sit back and relax. They're both very retaliatory peoples. So, 53k, rising wedge. I think Bitcoin is going to actually come down there. So, I'm going to leave my trade. At, let's see where my trade is on Bitcoin, on futures. Order 53k for 20 Bitcoin. I'm going to leave it. Let's see what plays out. We've got the weekend. We've got this retaliation possibilities. I bought some alts. Um, Tesla was up 3%. You can also sign up down below to buy a bit. You get a $10 million bonus world series of trading till Halloween. JamesCryptoGuru.com. To join us in the telegram take the courses bitcoin is getting a bounce back right now you can see 66 500 went down to 65 but it is the weekend everyone now we're going into the weekend israel will iran will retaliate on israel so it could get much worse to be honest in the telegram there's right now 266 of you online 206 exactly how i got wrecked last cycle yes funny how they give us pumps for the week few weekends until people expect it then dump market makers are laughing ever not on us because we sold um dirty games i knew this was going to happen it gives them an excuse newcomers you can just see everyone discussing so i'm staying mainly in cash i think a bigger dump is going to come actually like when Iran retaliates. We don't know how bad it escalates. Even I went too heavy. I could have waited to buy. Like I still took on my spot. I still took a 10K loss, even though I'm nearly all in cash, um, ready to buy the dips and still taking a 10K hit, which is quite interesting. And this is my asset breakdown and percentages. So I'm nearly mainly in cash. Um, let's see how it plays out. Be cautious. Israel is attacking Iran right now. Here are the sell orders. I bought some. I bought some things. Uni, I could pick up more. World. World took a big hit on that news. It just dropped off a cliff as soon as the news came. Just like fell off. But I think Bitcoin will fall more. But World took like such a strong... Getting a bounce back. So I'm already in profits on my World buys. Um, you can see here, WLD, World... This is, I bought it just a few minutes ago, which literally caught the bottom again, or close to. Let's see how it plays out, but everyone, I'd be cautious. I'd stay mainly in cash. I'm going to buy extreme fee dips or retaliation. Hit the subscribe button, smash up thumbs up and a turn on the bell, and remind a comment down below. Did you listen to my warnings the last few days? Love you all. Have an amazing day. Pray for peace, everyone. Really, pray for peace. This is We don't want escalation. An eye for an eye and the whole world is blind. All these fucking leaders need to wake the fuck up. People are tired of war. They want 
happiness. They want peace. They want love for everyone. Pray for peace. Push your leaders all around the world for peace. Anyone that talks war or anyone that pushes war, they're evil. They're the devil. Vote them out. Call them the devil. Call them warmongers. Only vote for people and talk to people and push people that push for peace. Love you all. Have an amazing day and I'll see you all again tomorrow.